Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, we are going to discuss how to install Eclipse IDE on Windows 10. Before that, we have to install and set up Java JDK on our Windows 10 computer. So I had already made a video on how you can install Java JDK 13 on your Windows 10 computer. So the video link will be on the i button or you will get the video link in the description box. Now let us discuss how we can download and install Eclipse IDE on Windows 10 computer. For that, just search for Eclipse and open the link from eclipse.org. Don't worry about the download link. The download link will be on the description box. So this is the official website from where you can download Eclipse IDE 2019-12. So to download this version of Eclipse, just click on download now. Let me tell you that this is the latest version of Eclipse IDE. To download Eclipse ID, just click on this download button and here you have to select your operating system. So I'm going to download it for Windows. So I will click on Windows 64 bit and here just click on this download button. Here you can see it is downloading an Eclipse installer file. So it will take some time while it's downloading. Let me tell you that Eclipse is the most popular IDE used for Java development. So we are going to use this Eclipse IDE to develop our Java program. So if you are interested in learning Java, then we already have a playlist on Java tutorial for beginner. So the playlist link will be on the i button. You can check that playlist to learn about Java programming. So our download has been completed. Now let us open this Eclipse installer file. For that, simply click on this arrow icon and click on open. So here we have our Eclipse installer. So let me minimize the browser. So this is our Eclipse installer. From here we have to select Eclipse IDE for Java developer. Now if you want to use Eclipse IDE for other programming language, then you have to select the respective programming language. For now, let us install Eclipse IDE for Java developers. And it will automatically detect your Java JDK path and the folder where it's going to install and it will automatically create a start menu entry and a desktop shortcut. After that, simply click on install. Installation process will take some time. So wait till the installation process complete. Our installation is successfully completed. Now let us launch our Eclipse IDE. For that simply click on launch or you can simply close this installer and from here you can launch your Eclipse IDE. Here we have to select our workspace location. In this location all our Java file will be saved. If you want to change this workspace location then you can simply change this location by clicking on this browse button. And from here, you can select your location where you want to save your Java file. For now, let me keep it to default, then click on launch. This is the welcome screen of Eclipse IDE. Here you can see welcome to the Eclipse IDE for Java developers. If you want to know what's new in Eclipse IDE 2019-12, then you can click watch new. So I will leave a link in the description box. So from there, you can learn more about Eclipse IDE. For now, let me show you how you can create your first Java project using Eclipse IDE. For that, let me close this welcome screen. Now to create a project, you can simply click on create a Java project or you can click on file, then click on new, click on Java project. And here we have to name our Java project. Let me name it as test, then click on next. And here you can see this is our project hierarchy. In this source folder, all our Java source code will be saved. Now click on finish. And here we have to create our module info.java file. Always remember the name of module file will always start with small case letter. So let me name it as test. Then click on create. So here you can see here we have our test module which is module info.java file. Now we have to create our Java package. For that simply right click on this source folder, then click on new and here simply select package and here we have to name our Java package. Always remember that Java package name always start with small case letter. So let me use demo, then click on finish. So here we have a package called demo. Now right click on this demo package and click on new. Now you have to create your Java class file. For that simply click on class and here name your class. Let me name it as my Java and here just select public modifier and we have to select public static void main function then click on finish.
finish. Here we have our myjava.java file. So our package name is demo and our class name is myjava. And this is our public static void main function. Now let me show you how you can print hello world using java. For that just here write system dot out dot print ln and between this parenthesis use double quotes between this code let me write hello world and after completing every statement in java you have to use semicolon now to save this file just click on file and here you will find the option called save now to run this program click on run and here click on this run option or you can use shortcut Control F11 and here on the console you will get hello world similarly you can print different strings let me print welcome to the coder world YouTube channel so let me click on run then click on run and here just save the file and here on our console we have Welcome to the Coder World YouTube channel. So this way you can download and install Eclipse IDE on Windows 10. Now if you want to learn Java programming, then we have a playlist called Java Tutorial for Beginner. So the playlist link will be on the i button. So that's it for this video. If this video was helpful to you, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Bye for now. See you next video.